In the magical realm of little people, big world, where the lines between private and public are blurred, Karen Chandler recently revealed the dynamics of her relationship with her fiancé Matt Roloff's ex-wife, Amy Roloff. Two women moving in a complicated dance of coexistence, bound by ties to the same man. In an outburst of honesty and vulnerability, Karen shared on the show, Amy has always been a character I've admired. She's hilarious and our shared moments of laughter and occasional awkwardness just show how life can take unexpected turns. At the end of the day, we both shared our lives with Matt. This story isn't just about laughs and awkward moments, it's a saga woven through decades of trials and triumphs. Karen, 56, exudes a mixture of wisdom and warmth, hinting at a connection with Matt, 62, who has not yet been formally married. And then there's Amy, 61, a woman whose story with Matt stretches into the forever category. Karen's perspective sheds light on the unbreakable bond, Regardless of the twists and turns of fate, she and Amy are forever intertwined through their connection to Matt. Amy and Matt's love story, which began in 1987 and blossomed with the arrival of their four children, is a testament to an unpredictable journey of love. Even though they divorced in 2015 and Matt found a new beginning with Karen in 2017, the resilience of love shines through. Amy, in her own journey, found the warm embrace of love again with Chris Merrick, and 2021 marked the beginning of their married life together. But let's not gloss over the intricacies of combining families and past relationships. Amy recently shared her feelings about collaborating with Karen at a charity event, describing the experience as somewhat awkward. Yet, despite the discomfort, they both put the greater good first, demonstrating the complexity of human relationships and the capacity for growth and collaboration. Raising funds for the American Midget Athletic Association became a kind of battleground, not of conflict, but of bringing together different organizational styles for a noble cause. Matt, always the mediator, suggested letting Amy take the lead, recognizing the strengths and weaknesses of both Karen's methodical planning and Amy's more spontaneous approach. This strategy, while it may have caused some tension, emphasized the deep respect and recognition of each other's contributions. This story is not just a peek behind the curtain of celebrity life. It is a mirror that reflects the complexities we all face in relationships, both past and present. The beauty of their story lies in their ability to coexist, collaborate, and even celebrate their journey together, despite the winding paths that brought them here. So, Dear viewers, what do you think about this complex tapestry of relationships? Can the past and present be united with grace, or will the road always be a bit rocky? Share your thoughts below, because this conversation is too interesting to end here. And if you're enjoying these deep dives into the hearts and minds of our favorite celebrities, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Your support makes a huge difference, and it allows this little channel to continue to share with you all the delicious details of the glittery world we love to admire so much. This has been Julie, your guide to the stars. Stay gorgeous, keep shining, and I'll catch you on the next wave of celebrity news.